The approved vaccination site for sheep and cattle is the anterior or front third of the neck. To administer a sub-Q vaccine, angle the needle at 45 degrees to the skin, so the needle penetrates the skin but not the underlying muscle. To ensure the needle does not penetrate the underlying muscle, use your finger and thumb to form a skin tent. This is the area that you vaccinate into. Gently push the needle through the skin and depress the plunger. This should be relatively easy to do. If you feel resistance, your needle may not be all the way through the skin, or you may be vaccinating into the muscle or underlying tissues. Adjust the needle position by pulling out or pushing in slightly and attempt to depress the plunger again. Also check your needle. If you are using a needle that is too small in gauge, it will cause difficulties, or it could simply be blocked. Watch that your needle has not travelled straight through the skin tent and out the other side. If this has happened, you will be vaccinating into air. An IM, or intramuscular vaccine, requires vaccinating into the muscle tissue. To do this, angle the needle at 90 degrees to the skin, so the needle penetrates the skin and the underlying muscle. The key points to remember are, the approved vaccination site for sheep and cattle is the anterior third of the neck. For a subcutaneous vaccination, the needle should penetrate the skin but not the underlying muscle. Use a skin tent and angle the needle at 45 degrees to the skin. For an intramuscular vaccination, the needle should penetrate the skin and underlying muscle. Angle the needle at 90 degrees to the skin.